This is the Cord A5 Ultra Ash. And y'all, it is a premium base completely outfitted with high-end components, including Fishman Fluence humbuckers. You have a hip shot bridge and hip shot tuners. And not only that, the craftsmanship, the playability, the feel, and just the tones all around are just out of this world. And the base itself is only a little over $1,000. So Cord is a brand that I'm relatively new to. But over the years, I've heard so many countless comments say, hey, you need to check out court bases. You need to check out all these different kinds of court instruments. And now that I finally have, it is really obvious that court is at the top of their game. After checking out the court C4 Plus OVMH last time and really being impressed with that instrument, I was really excited to really dig my hands in on their more premium line. And so the A5 Ultra Ash is really my time to really check out what court has to offer when it comes to that premium line. And y'all, it is really, really impressive. Like shockingly impressive on how much they're able to give you for such a low price tag. But before we really dig into the A5 Ultra Ash and for the sake of transparency, I do wanna say that this video is sponsored by Court, but that has no sway on my thoughts and feelings about this space and the opinions that I express in this video. So let's just go ahead and dig right in. So starting with the body, the first thing you notice just bam is that top. Wow, you have a mahogany body and an ash top. And y'all, man, we're doing a chef's kiss already. Just mwah, mm. Just all around from top to bottom, that ash looks and feels absolutely beautiful. With the C4 that I reviewed before, I was a big fan of the style of this bass. And with the A5, that doesn't change at all. I just think this is a very sharp and very elegant looking instrument. The body itself has an overall great weight to it and just insanely comfortable too. Then on the back of the body where you really see that gorgeous mahogany shine, you'll also see the string through ferrules as well. This goes to your hip shot trans tone bridge which keeps in tune perfectly. And this is my real first experience with this particular bridge and just more so hip shot bridges in general. But man, I am thoroughly impressed with it. Then moving to your electronics, you have the Fishman Fluence pickup set with it, which I absolutely love. Both the bridge and neck pickup have their very distinct sounds as well as the preamp. For your controls, you have your volume knob, which is also a push pull for single coil mode. Then you have your pickup balance between your neck, bridge, or just blend of the two. And then for your EQ controls, you have bass and treble. Then below that, you have your three-way toggle switch, which switches between the three distinct voices of the Fishman Fluence set. So whether you wanna go from heavy and boomy or just a more mid sound, or just a complete scoot, really funk sound, you're really able to get it all with these electronics. Then moving up, you have your neck through five piece maple and panga panga 24 fret neck. And y'all, this neck feels so superb in so many ways. I love that it's neck through, it really does sustain for days, especially because it's string through as well but really the feel of this neck is so natural and so fluid too. I appreciate how wide the string spacing is, especially when you go really high up that neck up to that 24th fret. And then it's completed with the really comfortable and smooth panga panga fingerboard that has the offset dot inlays as well. Then finally moving up to your matching headstock, you have hip shot ultralight tuners, which just keep in tune perfectly.
so overall with the A5 Ultra Ash, there's a lot to love about this base. And really with the playability, the feel, and just the overall insane amount of tones you can get with it thanks to the Fishman Fluence electronics. And really that's what's superb about this base. All these premium components working in tandem with that master craftsmanship, as well as just the feel and overall playability that just make this base an absolute steal for the price. Again, just a little over $1,000 for something that could easily be twice that price. But of course, let me know what you guys think about the A5 Ultra Ash and other court models as well. I kinda wanna try a few others out, so let me know which ones you guys are interested in. But thank you so much for watching as always, for liking, subscribing, commenting, following me on social media, all those crazy things. I really do appreciate it, y'all. And a humongous thank you to my Patreon supporters right over here. Mwah. If you wanna be like one of these absolutely beautiful people right here and help support the channel every month and be included in things like early access to videos, giveaways, and more, then head on over to my Patreon page. But again, thank you so much for watching as always. And of course, no matter where in the world you are, stay safe, practice that bass, Wear your sunscreen, and I'll see y'all next time.